Flashback. So it's not that hard. I wonder how long it's gonna take Berger to... Never mind. Come with me, Bergy boy. Ah, oh, there we go. Finally got him. Pog. Right, wife. Life good. Wife gone. But I got him. End of flashback. Okay, new day, new recording session. Let's go. I finally fixed my microphone so that my mouse clicking doesn't sound like... Yeah. Anyway, I have a list of objectives, a checklist if you will, that I should take care of. I also want to get everything I need to solo Fuel Weaver, although I'm aware that I might not be able to fight it during the summer. Well, I should bundle some meat. I'm probably gonna spend a whole day doing that again. Man, I'm bad at managing my time. Okay, I want to get like two stacks of ice at least. Okay, I got all the ice I need. Now, next on the list is getting a Volt Goat farm. And by that I mean the automatic kind that Lactish Monster was kind enough to share with us. Okay, so I need a nice staff. But I don't have grass. No, I need to touch grass. Okay, I'm gonna need some stone walls. That should be enough. And now I just gotta get grass again. Oh my goodness. Oh, since I got the rope from here, I guess. There we go. And I'm gonna use this to hunt. How am I getting so many gears from this? I'm not complaining. Oh no, please don't take me to the D-Fly. Oh no. I am not taking that. Nope. Okay, okay, back on track. What was I doing? The farm. I need boards. I'll pick this grass while I can because I'm in dire need of it. Also, I gotta trap those geckos someday. <laughs> oh, yeah, I should probably get a, a lightning rod in here. I can do two hits. Yes. Okay, just gotta kill one more. Now I gotta chase away one of these. Anyway, I'll keep you safe in here, I promise. Freeze it. Please don't run away. There you go. It is safe. Now I gotta get the anemone from the boat. There we go. So let's have it like this here. Oh, I'm gonna need more walls. Now two gates in front. Last boat goat. Let's get you in there. There we go, he's in. Okay. Now, he is comfortable where he is because he's not always trying to get into one direction, so that's good. Now, this is his new spawn location. As long as this one here is alive, boat goats are going to keep respawning here and dying to the enemy. Which will farm me a good amount of Volko horns, I hope. Okay, that's done. Let me check that off the list. I gotta kill some Moose Goose for Weather Pains. Oh yeah, I gotta trap these. Hang on, give me a sec, give me a sec. Well, that's a rather inconvenient spot for a lower plant to spawn. Okay, I'm gonna need a whole lot of gates. And then just some fences. And I'm gonna trap the geckos in here. Because if the geckos run away... More geckos are going to spawn from this location, which is not something I want. Okay, nothing fancy, just just for function. I got those. Sweet. Now, I just gotta herd these guys in slowly. And by herd, I mean freeze and push, because these guys are annoying to move. Don't unfreeze, please, not until I push you in. Okay, he's in. Oh, it's full moon. I should probably go get Glamour, finally. It's only been 111 days, but better late than never. A few moments later. Okay, I want Chester to, to stay here next to the plants. 
Because his poop is pretty useful as fertilizer. Oh, I gotta break those. Okay, a little distraction. But this is on the list. I gotta get marble for my helm defense. Which will be done today, I promise. Okay, done. Now. One eternity later. Okay, finally. Hello, baby. Did you miss me? Oh, wow. Did you just spawn right under my eyes? That's not very nice of you. I think the Hound Defense is next on the list. So for that I need six catapults. A lot of twigs, a lot of grass, a lot of stones. And marble, oh boy. Now first I need a generator. Oh yeah, I keep forgetting. I gotta get a lantern chest. Because I'm tired of having to unbundle a stack of light bulbs whenever one lantern runs out. There we go, it's full. Now whenever one lantern runs out, I just grab another. And when all of them run out, I unbundle light bulbs and refill them. Okay, now back to crafting. I need the silk that I forgot to pick up from the quarry. Now let me check what, I, what else I need for the project. I'm gonna need a potter's wheel. Okay, I'm gonna go and touch some grass now. Okay, there's no moose goose here, sadly. I gotta get like six of these. Is there a moose goose in here? Nope. Okay, anywhere else? Oh, there we go. Mama goose is on the job. <laughs> For the first time in the history of DST, the janky aggro of moose goose worked in my favor. Ow. Because it gave me enough time to kill the nightmare creature without worrying. Ow. Okay, two to three, let's go with three. Three weather panes, that's like 30 down feathers. I already have like 10 in the base, so another moose goose is gonna be enough. I mean... Oh, what the heck? Wait, I got a rook, a knot, queenly figure sketch. That is a rare tumbleweed, huh? There she is. Eventually. Okay, maybe fighting moose goose. With a half-spoiled bat is not the best idea. Now I have all the feathers I need. And me too. I need healing. Here we go. Okay, I have more than enough feathers. Now let's touch some grass. I'm gonna go check the vault goat farm. And kill some of the goats from the other herd. Because I do need a lot of their horns. For the weather paints. After that... I gotta start working on the hound defense thingy. Please tell me the farm is working. Looks like it is, yeah. There's a rat there, so one died at least. This one's in the process of dying. Uh, let's see, where's the other herd? Nope. Man, what is the drop chance of this? Come on. No horns out of all of those. Thank you, Clay. Okay, I need a good bunch of duct tape now. Good bunch of duct tape. Uh, the ronks. Okay, first comes the generator. And then six catapults. Now I'm gonna need a good bunch of grass walls. The potter's wheel. Oh, they're not expensive. So it's gonna drop here, walls here, okay. I gotta break those, I misplaced some stuff. Okay, but that's good enough for now. Now I just gotta repeat this motion for about uh, 50 times. It's gonna be fun. You know, maybe some cobblestones here would be very, very nice. A useful tip for this kind of building is that you need to turn off lag compensation. Let me demonstrate. The drop is not going to be in the place you want it. Like so. See? It's out of line. Now if I disable it again. It is perfect, see? Oh no, hounds! 
This is not ready yet. Uh, all the annoyances at once. Back to work. Maybe I should fix my sanity now. There we go, we got veggies. Okay, now I get, need eight in the middle just for doubling up the quotas. Okay, good. Now just to create a choke point at the entrance. Let's go. I gotta take this. Okay, now break the wheel. Complete this wall. Now use this as a guide for the other ones. Oh, I made too many. Well, whatever. No one's gonna know. Okay, now I can touch the grass with a hammer. I gotta work on bringing some stuff to the caves now. A few moments later. Okay, let's get a chest here. Or stones and such, so that the mole arms don't steal them. Go back for some more stuff. Oh, let me see if I got any any horns. Oh, there's one. I just gotta kill this bad boy somehow without dying myself. Freeze it. Kill it. Get all of this before I get hit by the enemy. I have three horns. Perfect. Okay, so I can fight Yule Weaver if I'm lucky enough to find him. Oh, good thing I remembered, I also needed enough cactus flowers for another salad or one of Pearl's quests, so let me get two of those. I need food and sanity. Let's get this and this. Much, much, much later. This is where the insulated pack shines. It's gonna keep this healing and sanity food fresh for a, whew, for a long good while. Also, if I'm not mistaken, Hut should spawn in one of the mud biomes. I'll get some light flowers and mysterious plants for the journey. I'll wear the muggles. Maybe I can see Hutch. Does he even spawn where a lichen is? Oh, that's a real worm because it's wet. You see that? I'm not gonna fight it. Come on, Hutch. Okay, let's just go to the ruins already. I don't want this food to spoil on me. No monkey business, please. Couple of rooks. Come on. Oh no, that's another rook. Okay, now kill each other if possible. Chaos. Absolute chaos. Stop running so much. Okay, what do we have in here? It's a small guy, I can deal with that. Man, there's a lot of knights in here. I mean, I'm not complaining, because the bishops are annoying. I wish there was a more engaging way of fighting bishops than just tank and spank. No, using a lazy dessert is not an engaging way. I mean, lazy explorer. Oh, I found the crafting station. Heck yeah. Maybe I should stay insane for a while to farm some nightmare fuel, because I'm running out of weapons. How many of these do I need to repair it? Maybe that was a waste. <laughs> oh well. Okay, so this wing is done. I'll probably have to pass the monkeys this time. At least it's not nightmare phase. What's in here? This looks like a road. Ooh, the labyrinth, yes. That is great to see. Yeah, I'll just do right hand turns, avoid spiders by walking on the edge. Did I open these? Yeah, I'll open them when I'm, I come back to collect stuff. For now, I'm just here to kill the Ancient Guardian. 
So I don't care for the loot because I don't even have space to get the loot. Unreasonably scared. Probably because this is the first time I'm raiding the ruins solo. As sad as it sounds. Danny, where are you, Danny? Hold my hand. Nerfed on. I gotta kill this bad boy. Please don't trigger spiders. No. Good. Man, I don't remember mazes being so big. There's a trap here. <laughs> Why is that funny? Guys, watch out, there's a trap on the floor. Ooh, I found him. Okay, I don't know how many swords I need. I'll just make three to be so sure. Come on, big boy. I know they changed this fight. Now it's actually fun. Ole! Yeah, I can do plenty of hits. Ole! Ooh, that's a big one. Okay, all these earthquakes are not great for my ping, actually. Oh, I gotta watch out for those tentacles. What? They turned him into the hippo from Hamlet? That's a lot of hits. Dude, this fight is so fun. What did you say? I love it. Ooh. Ow. Okay, got a couple of unnecessary hits. You can easily get 15 hits. I like that about this fight. Do a jump, come on. Woo! Dude, 10 out of 10 update. This is the best bo uh, rework they've ever made. And it's not even a character. Okay. Oh boy. <laughs> they buffed the loot too, eh? I'd like to see that. Okay, I'm gonna bundle some of this. Depthworm's here! Well... Let's go. Okay, wrangle them up. Come on. Sync up your attacks. Okay, that looks good. Okay, if I get hit once, I am stun locked and dead. So no pressure. There you go. Uh, okay, let's keep exploring. Where am I going? <laughs> yeah, this maze is working. I'm very confused. The, the way to get there is so complicated. Like, I need a, I need a lazy desire to go from here to here directly. Because otherwise, you gotta go like this, whoop, to the right, all the way around. That is so annoying. Oof, that looks rough. There's a lot of them in here. That's just great. Oh, two green gems. Still good to pass. I'll pick them up. Getting low on armor. There we go. Okay, I think I've cleared all the mobs in here. That's nice. And Nightmare Face is over, so this is the perfect time to go back to base. Maybe I should uh, get some other gems in here for the generator. Actually, you know, wires for gold. Man, I was pretty slow with killing these. It took me like 10 days. I like this place because I don't have to go through monkeys to go to it. See? Uh, how many do you need? There we go. I have tool side here to craft with. I want one of these. So I want to make a deconstruction staff and it's going to cost me one gem as opposed to two because I'm using this amulet. Nice. I already got a style color staff from the Guardian so I'm not gonna craft one. I'll just make two of these. Dual side suit is nice. I need two of them for the ancient fuel weaver. Crown. Eh, I can craft it without the amulet. It's not that valuable. Yep, all is good. Two hours later. Uh, so I've done some digging off camera. Uh, 
not intentionally. So what happened was, after that last clip you saw, I took a bathroom break, and when I came back I forgot to hit record again. So I spent like a good couple of days just exploring, finding Hutch, and raiding the ruins without recording. I even spent a bit of autumn doing that, but uh, let me recap on what I've done. So after I killed all the mobs in here and killing the Ancient Guardian, I went back and crafted the stuff that you saw and then decided to look for Hutch. And the wiki said that Hutch spawns somewhere next to toadstools and uh, in mud biomes. So I think I found mine either here or here. I can't remember exactly. It was next to this one. I spent like two days looking for it because at first I thought it would be somewhere in here, but it wasn't. So anyway, after I found Hutch, I got a bunch of tools and cleared all the statues and broken clockwork in here. And I got a, a good bit of tool sight and gems, plus these wires that I'm about to trade with the pig king to get a good bunch of gold. <sighs> and to be honest, I did consider just rolling back and doing everything all over again because this big of a time skip looks kind of sus. I don't want to seem disingenuous, but if I roll back at this point, I already know where Hutch is. So this time I would actually be cheating. But you didn't lose anything fun or engaging anyway. It was just a bunch of exploring and uh, collecting loot. So let's just continue from here. Okay, I gotta drop some stuff that I don't need in here. Okay, let's go. Okay, now that I have a good bunch of gems, I can use these as fuel for my hound defense. And as hounds die, they drop more gems, which replenish the fuel. So it's it's self-sustaining. Okay, I'm gonna take Jester with me. And we're going to Pig King. Okay, now to make this easier. Now this is going to catch all the gold in a neat pile. As opposed to all over the place if I do it without the walls. See? See how nice that is? Let's go, fat man. Money, 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 money. Yippee! Now to pick all of this up. I am not gonna have enough inventory space for all of this gold. I don't think I'm gonna worry about gold anymore for a good while. Yep, multiple chests, in fact. Okay. Two chests to go, that's good for now. 